Welcome back to another gig log. It's the 16th of July, 2022. Tonight we've got uh, two gigs. We've got a festival in a farm in Wimborne. Uh, they've got hog roast and a bar and everything like that. So that'd be great. And Harry is DJing at a military function, which we won't be able to get any videos off or videos due to the nature of it. And then tomorrow we, we've got a kids party. I'm not doing kids parties on Sundays or any bookings on Sundays anymore just because I need a day off. I've got a full-time job as well and end up working seven days a week. So I'm honouring the bookings we've got on Sunday, but I'm not taking any more moving forward. Right now, I'm just enjoying, look at that. Enjoy the sun while it's there, while it lasts. This afternoon, we went about half past 12 to the farm set up. We're on a big trailer, which is nice. Um, and then there's a gazebo over the top because I didn't want my kit in direct sunlight all night. And then we came away, had a shower, chilled out. It's now 20 past six. We're heading back to the farm. I have no idea how many people are gonna be there tonight because it's been shoved everywhere online um, and shared and stuff, but there's an online event and there's only 16 people, I think, have responded to say they go, they're going. So it could be 100 people, it could be 200 people, or it could be 20 people. We'll have to wait and see. Okay, we're all set up. That's the kit there. It's the usual standard kit we've got um, and the gig starts in about 30 minutes time. If I'll come over here now, we've got Tucky's Hog Roast and Barbecue. So they're getting the scran on there. Oh, yeah. Nice hot food being served over there. And then when we go into the barn, we've got a lovely red carpet, as you can see. And we've got some raffle prizes over here. We've got blackjack, two blackjack tables and two roulette tables. They're from Deluxe Casino Hire. And we've also got a bar set up, as you can see, with draft. So yeah, it should be a good night. It's Sunday morning after the gig. Let's get the elephant out of the room. I brought that, I thought I'll wear it at kids' parties. I tried it, I hated it, and I will never wear it again. So it's forever destined to hang up in my garage. Move on, don't be distracted. I'm in the garage, I'm swapping out. I've got a kids' party today, so I need to change over some stuff, uh, make sure I'm all packed for the kids' party. Last night, Harry had a bit of a dead one at the military party. They are, sometimes they are dead because especially if, if they don't invite partners to these military parties, then it's just your work mates. And why would you dance? Why would you? Imagine, I mean, this was um, all male audience, right? So imagine like 30, 50 all males. You know what it would be like on the dance floor? The party I did, the charity do, was on borderline dead as well. <laughs> we had hog roast, disco, casino tables, and a raffle and a bar. And uh, we just about, there was a couple of dancers. It was, it was literally, I mean, I did the gig for free because it's for a good cause. It is what it is. Sometimes they're good. Sometimes parties are bad. Like if you're going out consistently every weekend, Gonna come across, you're gonna come across highs and lows. You're gonna cut, finish a party and be like, this is amazing, I can't wait. Last night, do you know what I was thinking on the way home? I was thinking, driving along, I had the missus in the car because she came, I was driving along, I was like, babe, 
I knew what my price is. Because <laughs> I thought, is this ain't worth it? You know what I mean? Um, but that's the roller coaster that you're on as a mobile DJ. Sometimes you're thinking, I get paid for this. What, what the hell? Like, people are paying me to do this. And then sometimes you're like, this ain't worth it. Mm -hmm.